guys, this is Wendy. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about awkward Yu-Gi-Oh moments. And this applies for you guys when you go to regionals, events, um, anything when you're dueling. Um, especially when you're in the finals. Ooh, especially when you're in the finals. So, uh, tell me if any of these like ever happened to you guys. So number one is my all-time, like I hate when this happens and I know it happens to a lot of people because I see it when they're like in the finals so you're in the finals all right and you either you're either holding your cards in order to um, figure out a play or you pick up one of your opponent's cards and you're trying to read it and all of a sudden you develop Parkinson's oh hey hey can I read that card number two is what in the beginning when you guys are cutting each other's decks and then you put them down and you both reach for the deck at the same time. All right, here you go, dude. Oh, is this my, my deck? deck? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm gonna go make out with my girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, dude. Take your time. So yeah, that might seem awkward for boys, but it's pretty awkward for girls too. Oh shoot! I'm sorry. Number three is the freaking rigged dice that you guys get the same number over and over until the day is practically over. Hi, hello? Hi, it's fine. Oh, oh, okay, go low this time. Okay, sounds good. Oh, oh. Number four is really awkward because it's when either of you guys change your sleeves and you can't hold on to them for your life like soap in prison and forget about it. Oh, here you go. Oh, be careful, my sleeves are new. Oh, right on, right on. <laughs> they are kind of slippery. Number five um, is the times that like, players have like disgusting heads and try to touch your card sleeves, and you're just like, oh, no, thank you. Uh, here you go, dude. All right, yeah. I, you can have the win. Number six is something I personally don't get that they're too preoccupied to even like pay attention to the game. Like, why are you even playing? Okay, so I'm gonna activate. Yeah, dude, you don't even know. Like, oh my god, like, oh my god. Um, can I. What? Oh, who shot who? Um, can you, um, I'm gonna activate this? Yeah. Um, okay, I'll, I'll set I'll set this card and, um. <laughs> oh, come on! Finally, number seven. Like, I don't know if this has ever happened to you guys, but, um, once I went to a tournament. And like the other person was like trying to guilt me into letting them win. Like it was very awkward. Okay, and I will attack for. Oh my god, I can't lose this one. I really can't. What, what do you mean you can't lose? Yeah, like I sold my house to build this deck. I, I really have to win. You sold your house to make a deck? Yeah, like I drove from Canada to be here. I really have to win. This is just a regional. Why'd you drive so far? I need the prize money to buy my mom's insulin. You know, you know how it is. Wait, what? All right, thank you guys again for sitting through one of my weird ass videos um comment below if um other awkward situations that have ha 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 awkward situations you see awkward situation for an awkward video <laughs> comment below if any of these awkward situations have happened to you or um any weird ass situations that happened to you so yeah um comment below and um i'll see you guys later bye